I know in Caveman, you and Skyler have a very great relationship and you're kind of one of the ones that support him in kind of finding true love. How was that in the movie? Skyler and I had a lot of fun. I think we were very lucky that we got along very well. <laughs> so the chemistry, I think, really comes off on screen. And we were at Herschel, the director, was really wonderful in letting us keep on going after a scene was done. We kind of were ad-libbing. A lot of the stuff that we ad-libbed and improvised is in the movie, which is great. So it makes it really real. And so there are a lot of playboys in L.A. Do you really uh, support like trying to get guys to find their true love, or do you like kind of the playboy vibe? I think each to their own. You don't want to push a playboy into finding a relationship because he'll just ruin that girl. So I think each into their own needs to take their own time. If they're in that phase in their life, then go for it. If they're ready to find a relationship, go for it. I think you can't force anybody either way. I love it. So people that haven't heard about this movie at all, what's kind of the overall theme that you think people would take from it? It's a real rom-com. It's a feel-good rom-com. Like Skylar was saying today, it's a great movie to go on a date. It's just you feel good afterwards. You, there's always a character in there you can identify with. And you, you're just, it's a happy movie. There's a happy ending. Well, I'll let you go after this, but speaking of dates, Valentine's Day is coming up. Are you going to bring anyone to your movie on Valentine's Day? I will not be here. Oh, so no. no. Where are you going? I won't. I'm going south of the border to finish a movie from last year. So, nope. <laughs> All right, congratulations. Thank Have you. fun tonight. Thank you.